Yo, what's going on guys? So in this video we're going over jungle. It's patch 14.4, so this is where Terminus got buffed and all that good stuff. So runes are going lethal tempo, triumph, tenacity, last stand, and then we're going celerity, water walking, attack speed, damage, and armor. We started with a uh, health pot in this game because we're up against Belveth. I, I don't usually start health pot, and you don't really need to on Warwick, uh, but since Belveth is a pretty strong duelist as well as warwick but she's a pretty strong duelist we ended up picking the health pot so i would look into doing sort of that stuff whenever you know that you're up against these stronger junglers so let's get it oh yeah and then we're also going attack speed we didn't go move speed uh or tenacity they don't have too much cc the uh ad is just there because like i said we're up against spell death we want as much early damage as possible for us doing those exchanges but anyways let's get into it Hopefully you guys enjoy the video. We're going to look to do a full clear. As always, it's pretty easy to do a full clear on this champ. Um, oh, oh, as I say that, I miss my, my uh, clicks. It's pretty pretty easy to do a full clear on this champ with the changes to the pet in Season 14. The AoE clear is much, much better. You just got to rotate and attack all the mini. Uh, all, all like the baby ones as well. Oh man, so holy. She doesn't have red. And blue. She going with all that. She is more blue. I'm down to go try this out. I'm down to go try this out. But I think she's picking up probably a boots and longsword, maybe. Ah, oh, damn. Unlucky. I had to just keep trying to fight. Good try. Ah, uh, not ready with this. Ah, uh, good try. Um, yeah, so we had lethal tempo stacked. Yo, this would be a good assist. Nah, not not anymore. The shield is so big in the early game. Uh, yeah, we had lethal tempo fully stacked, so that's why I was down to continue to fight. I mean, it's better than running because he, he was gonna catch me. That's all good. We picked up a D blade because it's just gonna give us ridiculous. Like for example, if we had a Doran's blade there, obviously it, there would have been a zero percent chance we, we would have had a Doran's blade there because it was so early into the game. But if we had a Doran's blade there, it would have given us the stats that we need to win that little mini one v one or just survive long enough. But it's all good. The chill music playing. That's my my apologies, but it's okay. Won't try to talk too much so you don't hear my annoying voice, you know? I'll try to get grubs in a sec. Before then. Nice. Wanted to give it to the Glen. Very good stuff. I'm gonna drop a ward over the wall near Grubs. Kinda like this area. Could have done a better ward. Could have done it further away from the wall. So I could see more around the corner, but it's okay. Not the worst thing. The point is we have vision over the wall. Cause yeah, she she's not sick, so she can't dash over the wall yet, but still. I want to know what she's going to do like this. Nice. W Max in the jungle. Sometimes, I mean, I think I might put, yeah, I'm going to put an early point in Q, level 7. Just because, uh, nice. Just because we are up against Belveth. So the extra healing is really good. You got to save your Q for her W, because her W is the knockup. That's just what, what, you, what you gotta do. This won't give us our uh, TM9 yet, but. It's all good. Okay, so she's holding the way for the Yasuo. 
I mean, she's not going down to drag. Even if she does, we have a vision for now, like 30 seconds. My red's about to spawn. And we know that she's bot side because of what we saw. Yeah, we're just gonna back. I know I know we saw her on our bot side, so this is risky to potentially lose our red here. But it's all good. I'm keeping uh, the yellow trinket for the time being, just because I don't know, like I've actually liked staying yellow trinket in the early game a lot more because vision is so important when it, with like grub spawning and with um, how much like pressure there is now on junglers to have vision on like grubs and dragon and stuff like this to rotate a little bit better okay, so still up we can actually push this out because bot lanes push no nah, dude come 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 oh okay i'm not gonna type yeah i was just gonna say oh okay but it's fine you never know how people in league of legends are gonna take it you know i think you're talking with attitude It's gonna give us six. We're going the new stride. Stride is a substantial buff. Got very, very good. I think it's gonna be nice on him, man. I might go stride into Kraken. That sounds like it's gonna be nice because we have lethal tempo. So whenever I go with these items that have a lot of attack speed, it just it's a no-brainer to go lethal tempo because it actually benefits you the most. Like Conquer isn't bad either, I will say. Conquer. Double fear. The double, uh, sorry, uh, double fear. The conquer is pretty good on this because you, you can use this for a conquer stack. You have the attack speed to get your conquer stacks quicker. All right, we're gonna smite this because we have two charges of smite. That's fine. It's gonna get down to, uh, might range whenever I need it most. Stop. I think, I don't know, man. I think with the new stride, the fact that it gives you like movement speed instantly and movement speed like go over decay over three seconds like i don't know man i think it's gonna be very 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 strong and there's no animation like there's no animation for it like, it doesn't stop you no, i shouldn't say no animation there's no interruption of the animation so let me put one point in q here I wanna go get grubs. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go get grubs right now. Though that's the bot lane. We got these grubs, and then another camp. We'll have enough for uh, stride. Oh here, man. Should be free here. Out of them all below 50. Or just at 50 is fine. Because then whenever they get the shield, you get the uh, attack speed. Okay, now I get the attack speed still, even though they have a shield. But I can't get, get them any lower. Pretty free kill here. If you die, you're greedy. So if you die, is just because of pure greed. Nice. Okay, so we have our stride breaker off of that. Absolutely huge spike. Having stride breaker and orange blade at 11 minutes. Jeez. I'm gonna wait for a pink lane, uh, pink lane, pink ward. 
We have Dragon two minutes, so there's not really too much that we have to worry about at the moment. We can kind of do our own thing right now. damage for such a quick animation like it's just really, really nice we can go mid you know he doesn't have flash Another thing is like you can just literally walk up and press strike breaker that they're slowed by 35%. Like it's a pretty substantial slow. Like 35% is nothing to ignore. Definitely nothing to ignore in terms of movement speed reduction. And it still gives you the jungle clear that you need because the Tiamat, the AOE, the active damage AOE. Man, dude, this is, this is rough. This is rough for the enemy team. It's a jungle, it's an, it's an all game diff. Every single lane got diff. Jungle diff as well. Actually kill her real fast. No, no, bro. There, 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 there's. I'm gonna scream, man. There's no. I was so down for that one v two. I was so down for that one v two, but I got. I, he still got that fear off, man. That's or uh, a knock up. Like the, the all of off. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. We're gonna get uh, steel caps, Randuin, and Spear Visage, I'm thinking. We don't need a lot more damage right now. We're gonna go Randuin's and then Kraken, I'm thinking. Randuin's Kraken is going to be really, really big. So annoyed at that death. It looked so bad. Cause I like ran into it. You have uh, an enemy. I do have smite still. I do not have alt, but I'm down for this. Yeah, we have some nice attack speed. Nice attack speed. Damn. Got some good damage, dude. Yeah, Rando is gonna be good because he has crit, she's got crit. to just buy our warden's mail and then we got a ruby crystal as well it's gonna be big for us yeah man like i don't know i've been really enjoying buying dorn's blade in the jungle i think it's like extremely beneficial oh i, mean, I honestly didn't mean to click it right there i meant to reposition myself Yeah, it's like it's extremely beneficial. Like 450 gold, you're getting nothing in comparison. Like, uh, 
nothing else compares to it. Is on fire. Sorry, what I meant to say. Like, just tons of value. We're only a thousand gold off this. This is gonna make us ridiculously tanky. If they have a heavy AD comp, and you build plated steel caps and randuins, you're just a raid boss. You're a raid boss. Got him, got him, got him. He did just does way too much damage with these items, man. It's crazy. But now he does no damage to us. Uh, now it's time for us to get a red trinket. For sure. There's really nothing up that we gotta worry about in terms of like needing vision for it. Like the team's starting to roam, so we're gonna start dropping vision. Other places, not just in the Nice. Very good. I like stride, I won't lie, man. Like, it's just, it's it's very strong to just walk up to somebody, then press slow. So this is going to be a substantial amount of damage, damage decrease. So, as you guys are going to see... After every fight, I'm gonna try to remember, like whenever I'm up, up against these people that deal crit, like so the three of them, I'm gonna try to remember to hover Randuins. To see how much damage it's mitigated from the crits. The rock solid is, is yeah, it adds up. But it's the uh, resilience. That's what's huge about it. Oh my, you gotta be kidding me, bro. Landing slow. Oh, the asshole's getting triple. Oh. Oh. So already 198 right there, so 200 damage. That's pretty good. And that's with like nobody having a ton of crit yet. Like the only person who is critting often is Yasuo. We gotta go. Uh, where is it? We're gonna try Crack and Slayer. See how it goes. It's gonna be nice because we are gonna be going tanky. So with Kraken. If you just build a lot of tank with Kraken and like one other damage item, and in this case it's Stride Breaker, you're in a really good spot because Kraken still deals a lot of damage. Like, right now it's dealing 225 physical damage on every third hit, and then it's it's doubled. Like, like 100%, right? So it's increased by another 225. So it's doubled if you hit them. Like, you can it like three times on them. It's insane. It, 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 it's crazy. We got a new purpose for this thing. We'll die pretty quickly. We'll just start this. No, I'm balling the wrong side. Bellbeth is just scaling. She's just scaling now, guys. Wow. Yeah, Terminus is just doing work on her. The Terminus and the Kraken is just doing work. She's just scaling. I really wish the bottling would have came to drag, but... Don't give me a Wow, what is Bellbeth? 
have. Okay. gonna be our third drag. Thing is, is like, I think we're gonna have to go after Kraken, we're gonna go uh, Anathema's and put her on the Velveth because since she has, so like, this is the counter, right? Since she has all that pen with like this, like Terminus, and then she's dealing a lot of physical damage still. Anathemas is going to just still neglect her pen because it's just like it just it, it is flat damage reduction. If I build armor, yeah, okay, that's damage reduction to physics, but he gets a ridiculous amount of armor. Pen. Oh my god, bro. I didn't think she had flash. That's why I didn't hold my Q. I wanted to get the fear off. You know what's awkward? I pressed my Randuins and my uh, Stride Breaker at the same time, but it didn't go off, I guess. Because it was only using one active at a time. I don't know, because I pressed them both, but I just realized after. Keeping it refreshing the game, eh? I like it. I like that. The, 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 the. I like that it's turned into an actual game. I don't like when games are a stomp. I never do. Unless I'm like climbing on my main. I never like whenever games are a stomp. It's just. I, don't know. I like whenever the game's like, tw like 25, 35 minutes long. Whenever there's actual like team fights and stuff. It just keeps it like fun. Like, like you're playing the game. Are able to test out builds and such. I guess still on drag. Who knows? It's still mine, right? Oh yeah, they changed it before you you were able to click it to see if it was yours. It would like show you the name beside them. Now if you just do that, it has no like map. It's cool. I don't know how old that changes or how new that changes. But we got cracking, which is big for us. You just bought a death stance straight up. Oh my god. She just bought a death stance straight up. Jeez Louise. Mm, you're doing all this without me here? I don't know about this one, team. I don't know about this one. I don't know about this one. Why start the fight? Why start the fight when I'm in base? That's wild. They're gonna do Baron. I'm never there, whatever. I realized it was a mistake. To engage like that. Like 
top. See, look. Look at why... Well, why are they doing this? nuts you're nuts you're nuts i landed a three-man spear three man. <laughs> you're nuts bro just because this person is now dying outside of lane because it's just like, you gotta love people man you gotta love it i'm gonna go the like i was saying at the end it was that was such an avoidable fight like none of us needed to die there none of us <laughs> Oh my god, Velvet is a machine. <laughs> That's crazy. She didn't take my, my uh, blue. She probably already... Oh, Watch this, I'm going to say something. That's going to tilt them. I was thinking if we were able to kill her without alt, then we would have had our alt to go mid. I mean, yeah, we got the one for one. Watch one. I'm gonna say uh, there's no point. It was it was two minutes ago. I was gonna say that because um, he's like, oh, you're you're only in this game because of bot. The only reason we died that three for zero or zero for three, depending on how you want to word it, is because of bot. But yeah, it's just Belveth, man. She is just too much right now she's too much she's probably like one of the best scaling champs in the game with the new terminus and kraken and everything is just insane but once we get this man we're gonna be super tanky versus her yeah okay she does true damage from her passive but that's not what's really killing us it's the fact that she has all this pen from terminus and uh the attack speed and everything just makes you crack in twice, all this stuff, right? I messed up. I shouldn't have used my Strybreaker to kill those there. Okay, well, there's really nothing. So we're gonna, just going to buy our Anathemas right now. Oh, wait. I got rid of her E, boys. Please, thank you. Her E is the only reason why she's like carrying the game. There we go, the FF. GG, well played. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. That ended up being a good, good game. Other than that, thanks for watching. Peace out.